inimitable style on the keyboards is the one and only Peter DeZoza. Uh, uh, I mean, did that, hit that keyboard playing, um, does that remind you of Genesis? Because you know, I went on and like, I, I try to like, get some information on everybody when I'm hosting, so I go on uh, the interweb and I, and I look them up. And, um, and then there's like the stuff that the artist puts on the page, but then there's stuff that's like some program, some algorithm, tell, you know, use, they use to suggest things. And it says, sounds like Genesis. Genesis. So, yeah. <laughs> so have, are any Genesis fans out there? That are like, you know, Genesis I mean, has a long history. Yeah, so if you're a Genesis fan and a Peter DeZosa fan, you're in a real big treat tonight. <laughs> so, uh, but I, I was really happy to be doing the same night as Peter because he, he wasn't at the original Anti-Folk Fest, but he was... He showed up on the scene shortly after, and he's been one of the guiding voices of this scene for a long time. And he's one of my favorite performers, and he, he, he sets himself apart from the other people stumbling and bumbling around with guitars. So, uh, I'll be at the piano. Yeah. <laughs> no, I really, you know, every time he gets on stage, it's like a breath of fresh air. Even, no matter how good all the other songwriters are in the night, you know, Peter comes up and he takes you to another place. So I'm very happy to be here tonight to see this show. So let's have a big welcome for Peter DeZosa. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Kurt Kelly. And with Fleming, too, on the percussion. Fleming Larson from the um, Question of Solitude. You may remember him as Robert Bridgewell in the James Bond musical. <laughs> and other work in the uh, movie field. So this one is called The Longer We Live. How's it sound? Uh, let's see. The longer we live, we can't avoid the doing of the things we do in order to survive here. The more behind me, the more defenses gag me. All I want is outside of my obsolete awareness. Yet you look to me as someone of authority My expert actions coming back to haunt me The more I look at a screen of entertainment For answers when I seek my inner courage Looking for a place to 
new floater family and we welcome all the families to join with us and we're especially fascinated by the flames.
show. So we're playing a lot of the new music. I don't know if anybody has any requests. If they do, I'm happy to hear them, but I don't know if I can play them. Um, this uh, next one is somebody from the water who is attracting uh, the, the father of this floater family. Uh, and that, because of her wild smile, he's, he realizes that if they join together, they probably could save the world. You know, it's not a sexual thing at all. It's not just a simple attraction. It's more like salvation is somehow represented. Again, that, my main frame of reference is the Ghostbusters. I think the idea that the two people would come together was used in that. So there are a lot of good story elements from Ghostbusters. Why hash the good times with the bad times? I don't remember either. The paths have blurred to me, but sometimes when you would brush your teeth and smile, were menders eye and were your eyes? They pierced a membrane in mine. Nibbling bites make holes humongous Within our fish that made of hell family is much more rambunctious and they, they take unnecessary risks. Let's add the gesture to the harmless pause or gesture. 
that is done when there was not one gives it gravitas and punch I bite my hands cause it's too much so you see I made a gesture is it more or something less than what it seems when what I'm feeling is at the bottom of the sea and as you raise it's praise is strong, it's praise are long. It's happening now, it's out of control, it's powers arrive to explode in the air from the floor of the ocean and rose to the sky like a hovering canopy ready to fly while the old goes right on living he's afraid he will die to prevent that he is extra cautious of the clouds in the sky through the moonlight in the new light we're dancing for your love light through the moonlight in the new light we're dancing for your love It's called Tiffany Symbol Search. It connects with oh, ooh, the families that are being created as we speak all around us. We have uh, Summer has a baby, and uh, Dan Costello and Rachel have children, and uh, so the families. Well, and this is a song from a while ago about uh, you know feeling the uh, the need to have a family. Maybe they haven't found each other, but they are uh, addressing the expectation that perhaps. This is right for them. It's called Tiffany Symbol Search.
Uh, yeah, so uh, how's everybody? We have a very great night of music ahead. I'm looking forward to everyone playing. Um, all right, the, the next, so, so I know those are, th this is a song, uh, sort of a, there's a father figure looming in the distance in the ocean floater family. There's also a mother, and the mother is below the sea at this point, and so there's some memory of her as well. Uh, well, the, because they both are, uh, you know, they're, they're spirits, they're present on the boat even though, because they, they lived there so many years before. Uh, and this is a song uh, called Mama, Mama. And I, I mean, I don't think we played it before, it's kind of a pulse song. <laughs>
It's called what? The Expendables. Oh, The Expendables. The Expendables 2. The Expendables 2, okay. That is the song of Red Hook, Brooklyn. The nays have it, the nose knows. Can you tell me a little bit about this? Oh, okay. It's another ballad in a non-tante feel. It's a bridge of your nose and think happy thoughts. Goosebumps cover your arms. Justice is served by men whose slates are dirtier than yours. Good triumphs in a pool of bad blood. The lowest of the low is the traitor, the betrayer of his partner. The second nearest low is the watchdog who corrupts. in the chain of command somewhere near the end of the dangling chain with the rest of the expendables we are expendable working at the docks is a nasty business you only get a wince when you ask what is this everybody wants you to eat your breakfast then just go away them at the docks near the gates of Paris, betting on the back of the scenes of towers. Who needs trials at the end of the day? When the system's corrupt, water seeks its lowest level as it slips through many hands. You enforce the laws, but what happens there is just Adjust your judgment to the facts. These are the acts of the expendables. We are expendable. Working at the docks is a mess. 
nasty business. You only get a whiff when you ask what is this. Everybody wants you to eat your breakfast. Then just go away. Leave them at the docks, they'll take their towels. Going through the stops and skimming off the top. Who needs trials at the end of the day? everybody. We will be back in just a bit with more music at the Anti-Flash Fest.